so bad, but it's the Vegitos. But yeah, all right. He's saying he's saying <laughs> he's hi. Raven. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Anyway, we got Yoshi. Let's see what a character, what a name like Flamey Hot Vegitos is gonna play. DK. That is exactly what I was looking for. We're gonna yeah, get I'm this match started. Very excited, especially you know Yoshi versus Donkey Kong. This was historically not very great for Donkey Kong in Smash Four. I haven't got to see a lot of it in this game, but. You know, without him having the dunk, the ding dong, aside from you know specific platform setups, and Yoshi just kind of being a better character overall in this game, I can't imagine it going very great for him already. What yeah. a start for Michael! <laughs> That's pretty difficult to come back from. DK, his biggest weakness in this game is probably just the edge guarding factor. They took away that arm intangibility. It's not as prominent as it was before in Smash 4. So it makes it really difficult and you can just hit right through it most of the time. And Maiko not giving up at all. Just continuously relentless on flaming hot Vegetos right now. But he's going to be able to get those back air strings. Put him off stage. And that Big potential here. Still a giant hitbox. Great tool for Donkey Kong. The down smash coming out for Maiko. Bounces it off the ground. The double... Uh, the double jump armor powering through the up and game in there forces him off stage and he goes off and gets another dunk. Michael starting off real strong right now. Yeah, I mean he's just starting off with no respect. It's a very interesting game plan, especially if it's against someone that you don't necessarily. A minute oh, no. has passed. We have two stocks and a shield break from Michael. What's he gonna go for? Okay, falling up there, up to up to into up there. Very nice stuff. Gets a nice solid amount of damage inside. So trying to go for the charge, but there we go. Gets the down B into all smash. Great confirm coming from Flaming yeah. Hot Vegeta. I mean, that is one of DK's newest tools in this game. Very very entertaining to watch. He is able to land with that, uh, with the ground pound. Gets the up the or the up smash rather afterwards. That's a kill confirmed that he does have. But now he has to find somewhere off the ledge. Great grab from Michael calling out the spot dodge. Goes up there with the up air, but the or uh, the side B super armor. Excuse me. Yeah. Uh, but can't armor through that up smash. That's gonna be a two stock. For Michael. Yeah, that's difficult to get around because Michael was already saying, I'm going to edge guard you every single time if you try to just go for the ledge. So he tried to go high, mix him up a little bit, maybe interrupt his animation on startup. Didn't quite work out there. So, playing out Vegito's, he tried to do the mix up. Didn't quite come as planned. Michael's already a step ahead. And Michael, you know, he just played that game plan of, I'm not going to respect you until you give me a reason to. And Flaming Hot Vegeta just didn't. Yeah. I mean, he definitely came in with a very solid game plan of what he's going to do to that Donkey Kong. Executed it perfectly. And now the Donkey Kong is not coming back. Roy is stepping up once again. Alrighty, Roy. I mean, that is, that's where the Flaming Hot comes from, probably. <laughs> so, we'll see how this goes down. Starting off with more neutral this time around, Maiko not quite going in as hard against this type of character. I think he gives a little bit more respect to this type of archetype instead yeah, of uh, DK. Disjoints are very strong against Yoshi since he doesn't have any of his own. He, you know, you are able to beat out a lot of his approach options with things like a sword. Mm -hmm. But even then, it's, you know, not impossible for Yoshi. Yeah. I mean, technically speaking, oh, tech chase situation, not going to get the double-edged dance, but he ends it on double-edged dance three. That's really minus on block, so that's going to be a big opportunity for Michael to get something going. Tech chase situation, no jab block, though. But flaming on Vegito's with this character, he's been keeping things a lot closer this time around. Yeah, this is looking very good for him right now. Actually has the percent lead onto Michael. Great parry on the up there, but he cannot get off the platform. Constantly just getting poked from below until eventually his shield cannot take it. He does get hit with the up air, and once again, we have a reset to the neutral. Michael calling out that roll away with the up air. Yeah, Vegito's tried to give him the space because he was expecting the double jump to come in so that he would be able to get a reversal or potentially get the kill there, but did not quite happen. So Michael's going to get back on the stage for free, and he's using the exit to protect himself. The down beat actually clips just nicely, and of course, you can choose to go through the platform, <laughs> so that will be his option there to be able to seal out that stock. Yeah, now Michael just going to play this lead patiently. He knows that he's at kill percent to a lot of things that Roy has, and that is one of them, the jab into the back air attack. Yeah, great go confirm. Already doing much better than the DK game, oh, for yeah. sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, Roy but. was definitely the pick here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but Michael is still showing off that new frame 3 nair that Yoshi has to be able to combo break a lot of stuff. Get out of a lot of strings. He's trying to push buttons more, though. Flaming Hoppy Jesus is continuing to string, but he's going to get caught in his own. Both of them up bearing each other for lots of damage on each other. And still challenging that down B, oh! but it gets reversal there. The runoff there just... Vegito's is bane right now. Yeah, and it really seems like... Michael started to understand what buttons he can and can't press against Flaming Hot Vegito's here. 
But unfortunately, the only button he had left off stage to press was the air dodge button, and it did not travel far enough. Yeah. Ooh, he tried to spot dodge too. Thought that the last hit would interrupt him before he tried to go for the grab. Back airs? Yeah, the back airs. And it's like, okay, you know what? I have a disjoint too. Yoshi's tail moves are all disjointed as well, if only very slightly as well. So you can <laughs> you can use that as a spacing move every now and then. Yeah, it's a it's pretty nice in this game. Yeah, no jab lock, but still gets the hit check and is able to get that down B to be able to continue that string. Yeah, Michael's been making great use of the down B special attack in this game. This game specifically, it's played a big role in his match here. All right, double edge dance. Puts him off stage one more time. Big chance for Fujitos to be able to try and bring this up around. Will he be flaming hot or will he just be the plain old regular Cheetos? And it looks like he's doing just fine putting him off stage one more time. What's the option going to be? Goes for the double jump. Grab the ledge. Oh, goes really unsafe with that forward tilt. Oh, no way! He counters it! And that's going to be the game going to Flaming Hot Vegitos. Yeah. Spicy! <laughs> that that counter was very spicy. Michael thought that he was that he just had him completely open. And he's like, you know what? I haven't pulled out this option. I'm just going to go he for it. pulled out a single time. That was the perfect time to unveil the trump card there and take that game two away. Yeah, that's, now, how, you, that's how you get mixed up, man. And it's going to be the counter pick here to Suzaku Castle version Battlefield for Michael. I like it. I love seeing when players go to these Battlefield versions of stages. We have so much wonderful music in this game that <laughs> yeah. doesn't get enough appreciation. Mm -hmm. And almost all of the stages are available here go on either Battlefield or, or the Omega version. But yeah. we just don't see it very often. I'm mm -hmm. glad we get to. Yeah. I don't know if I really uh, think that... I think this is a very safe pick for Maiko. I mean, I've played him a couple of times in this game, and every time we went to Battlefield, it's just, uh, it's just very difficult to get around. This is, I call this the Yoki... He calls this the Yoshi Cage, basically, where it's like, okay, you're going to stay inside where these three platforms are, and then I'm just going to keep beating you from all sides until you can't take it anymore. But looks like the two are keeping things close. The four tilt going to put him off stage. Yeah, I mean, Battlefield has historically been pretty good for sword characters, and Flaming Hot Vegito showing us why, just spacing out under this platform, making it very difficult for Maiko to jump in on him. That down B as a, you know, whiff punish on that combo is going to come out, parry into the up tilt! Yeah, do you think that parry is intentional? It looked very intentional yeah, no. to me, yeah. <laughs> Especially like, no, the unintentional ones are when you get it, and then you just shield again, because you don't, you didn't realize you got it, you know? Yeah. But anyway, that was... <laughs> 100% intentional, drops the shield, gets the parry, and the up tilt takes the stock away from Maiko. Yeah, completely intentional there. Very nice stuff from Vegitos. And Maiko trying to find that chase, but he's not quite finding it. There we go, gonna catch yeah. him, sticking onto the platform, gonna get that up smash. Yeah, and that's the one thing Yoshi does have that he likes a lot on these platforms, is his up smash goes through it, so if he forces you into a tech situation up there, he has most of your options covered with an up smash. <laughs> The dash attack just catches him, miss spacing. Oh yeah, he's respecting his space. He's just right outside of the range where he's actually starting to hit Michael or even pressure his shield. And the pressure comes in there. Going to be able to shield poke there. Yeah, no parry on the down air that time. Going to just trap Flaming Havadrios in shield and then actually shield poke him afterwards. Oh, the air out of shield. Puts him off stage again. What's the option going to be? Sticks onto the platform. Will he do a run up up smash? Yeah, he's allowing him to go back inside. Oh, jab into the uh, down beat. It's not going to be able to finish off the stock from him. Flaming Hot Vegios, but it is some good damage on Putting him in a very vulnerable percent. And he's been clipping, getting clipped by these eggs very much so. It's very difficult because when you get the right egg on the arc. Oh my oh god! Oh my god! He comes charging a forward smash and just runs straight through it. <laughs> yeah, he's very brave. He's like, you know what? I'm at 140. You, you know, might as well. It's a do or die moment for me, potentially, to make the upset right now. Putting him off stage one more time. Still a big opportunity. But again, these eggs, they're just right inside the space where he wants to try and use his speed to pressure. And then he's being able to interrupt how he pl uh, applies his movement. Well, I like the egg bounce right there. Just comboing egg into egg into egg. Goes for the down B shield, times it perfectly to catch Flaming Hot Vegito's popping out of the egg. Oh, it catches the roll though, puts him off stage again. Yeah, at that time he's respecting the egg and he's trying to get around it. Very smart stuff, yeah, I mean, just shielding it, being more aware of it. Not getting hit as this, as many times as not, but it's a too little too late because Michael's still trying to tack on the pressure here. Yeah, and this up tilt not working for, for Flaming Hot Vegito's once again. 
Michael really trying to run away with this landing photo, but it's the sour spot, so it's not going to kill. Yeah, uh, you saw that Michael was trying to pull out something. I think maybe a forward smash or an up smash, and that landing dead double edge dance that will be able to close out the stock. Michael with the invincibility though, command grab into oh. the down B, just catches him on the chase. Looks like he DI'd straight up. Vegito's putting yeah. up a very nice and fight. That was wonderful, great play from him. Unfortunately, he did actually jump into the down B. It didn't catch him out of the thing or out of the egg, but he was scared. Yeah. Sometimes that's all it takes.